guys. Thank you all for tuning in to Big Mama Story Time. Story Time! Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment to my page. Here we go. Hi, guys. Thank you all for tuning in to Big Mama Story Time. Today, I will be reading to you guys a Disney Animals storybook collection. All right, guys. All right, so the last one that I read was The Jungle Book, It Takes Two. This will be Mickey and Friends, Donald Duck, and the Dairy Farm. All right, guys, let's get into this. All right, there it goes. Donald Duck and the Dairy Farm. Early one summer morning, Mickey... Mouse, Donald Duck, and Donald's nephews arrived at Grandma Duck's farm. They had promised to take care of Grandma's cows while she was on vacation. Mickey and the boys found the cows drinking from a pond. Mickey, Huey, Dewey, and Louie led them into the barn, but one cow would not move. She was standing behind a big round bale of hay. Here, cow! Here, cow! Donald called. <laughs> Trying to get her attention, huh? Mickey and the boys hurried over to see what was happening. Next to the cow stood a little calf. This must be Rosie and her, little, and her new calf, Mickey said. We're supposed to take the calf to the barn and help it drink from a bottle. Donald tried to lead the calf to the barn, but Rosie blocked his way. He tried to push Rosie aside, but she pushed him back. Soon Rosie was chasing Donald around the pasture. <laughs> She's like, don't touch my baby. <laughs> Meanwhile, Mickey, Huey, Dewey, and Louie led the calves inside and fed it. Suddenly, Donald dashed into a milking stall with Rosie close behind him. Donald slipped away from the cow, slammed the stall's door shut, and leaned against it. Guess I showed her who's boss, he said, wiping his forehead. <laughs> Still scared. And tied at the same time. Donald watches Mickey and the boys attach the other cows to the milking machines. That looks easy, he said. But when he tried it with Rosie, she pushed him over and started to run. Whoa! Donald shouted, grabbing her tail. As Rosie dragged Donald through the barn, his feet got tangled in the hoses that carried milk to the storage tank. Snap! One of the hoses came loose, milk spray everywhere, soaking Donald from head to toe and splashing in his eyes. Donald stumbled over ho hoses and milk cans and bumped into doors. Finally, he put his foot straight into a bucket, tripped and fell into a feed bin. Oof! Donald gasped as he climbed out covered with bits of mashed grain. That's it! Donald grabbed an old milking stool and a bucket and marched toward Rosie. I'm going to milk this cow the old-fashioned way, by hand. <laughs> when Rosie saw Donald approaching, a sly glint came into her eyes. As soon as she, he got close enough, she gave him a powerful kick and see him flying through the air. Splash! Donald landed head first in a full can of milk. Mickey pulled Donald out of the can. I think you've helped enough for, the, for today, he said. We'll finish milking Rosie. Mickey calmly milked the cow, and then the boys put her in the stall with her calf. After their chores were done, the gang trooped back into the house for a rest. That's because you came at her already in this court. Meanness. She was like, uh-uh, you can't touch me. <laughs> Just then, Grandma Duck drove up. I miss my cows too much to go away, she said. Hmm, I hope I never see another cow again, Donald said. Hmm, Grandma said, handing out gifts to everyone. That's too bad. Mickey opened his box and everyone began to laugh, even Donald. Inside was a huge piece of chocolate and it was shaped just like a cow. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> that is the end of Mickey and Friends. Which one is this one? 
Mickey and Friends, Donald Duck, and the Dairy Farm. All right, guys. Thank you all for tuning in to Big Mama Story Time. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my page if you haven't done so already. All right, guys. Bye.